was a, it was a strange game because um, I don't. I, I mean, we, we did the hard bit. We kept them up quiet, um, but we just never sort of pushed on and that. And then, but we was fighting against the referee today as well. It was absolutely shocking. I mean, he's, he wasn't going to give the one, the second one. You know, what I don't understand VAR, it's just completely gone out the window. Two stone wall penalties, and like I said, the second one, he's only just, just give it because he's been told to go and check the VAR. But um, you, you've, got to you've got to take your chances. And Harry Kane will be absolutely gutted with that because, I mean, it's it went so far over. It was just, oh, so disappointing. It really is. He ain't going to sleep tonight, is he? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not a fan of Gareth. I think his football's quite defensive. I like more attacking football. I don't know. For me, he's had a good go. I didn't think we were as strong or as passionate, dynamic as we could have been. First half wanted us to grab hold of the game. Jury's J- out for me. But personally, would I be sad to see him go? Probably not. Yeah. Um, if, like I said, if Harry Kane would have scored that on pen, it would have, you know, been a game changer. But. Um, going to you know to get knocked out but good luck to France I reckon they'll go on and win it now you know Harry Kane he's stepped up he's missed a penalty but fair play to the bloke he's been brilliant for England so it's one of those isn't it you know you win some you lose some but you know it's what could have been but uh, good luck to France I, th- I think I think I think the, I think the worry with Gareth is is that every time that we've come against quality opposition we've just fallen a little bit short and looking at the players we've got, could we have gone for a little bit more? Could we have been a little bit more assertive? Um, we said in the first few games he was playing it around the back, sometimes a little bit slowly. Um, so maybe next time Gareth is going to learn from this one. We're getting closer, even though it wasn't the final. It was. You know what, though? We played well throughout the whole tournament. Like There were some standout players. Saka tonight was outstanding. Kane, you know what, he played really well and he got that first Pino in and then hit it over the top. But they deserve to be here. We deserve to have played to this level, you know, and it was anyone's game in that. Yeah, I, mean, when that... I don't know, you know, more of the same. He's given us a spirit, he's given us that belief again. Um, he got the guys here as much as anyone else and so he deserves nothing but praise from England fans. For you, you stick with him? Of course I would, absolutely. Get him, get, go again, Gareth, go again. Yeah, we were the better team today and I think Southgate's kind of just, uh, his game management is, is so good and I actually think it went to plan today. We just gave them more chances than we did uh, Senegal, right. USA. Um, uh, yeah, they were just uh, they were just more clinical, weren't they? Um, I'd really like him to stay, to be honest. I think, yeah, I think uh, there's no one out there that I would prefer. I think he's fantastic in tournaments, and yeah, as I say, the uh, his, his game management's really good, and he's got the, the kind of belief that we can go far in tournaments every time we we enter one. So stick around, I think. <laughs> oh, this is this has been outrageous. Yeah, I came over here uh, in August. Um, I've been to 12 games. About two and a half K down, but it's in 43 goals. <laughs> and yeah, it just wasn't to be this time, but yeah, it's been absolutely outrageous. I'm not got so near, but so, let me sum it up very quick. It's better to lose in a stadium than it is to lose at home. That's for sure. Because I don't even really feel that bad. You know what? Better luck next time. It happens. But I'm an England fan till I die, baby! Sweet! <laughs> <laughs> is he going to be here? Is he going to be here for the next World Cup? You think? Personally? No. No? No. I mean, he's done well, but maybe next time. Come here, bro. You plan to join me? Yeah, he's got a couple of words to say. Yeah? Yeah? Tell me, Go tell on. me, what do you think? Well, uh, about what? About the match. Uh, the match was uh, fairly contested. England uh, deserved to win, but didn't win. They played fairly well. But uh, I am... Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I was just saying to Sean, very disappointed because you look at the teams in the, in the semi-final, there's no one that's as, that we can't take care of. It just didn't go away tonight. I mean, normally Harry Kane will stick that in the back of the goal. We win 3-2. I, mean, even- I think the general consensus is Gareth's done a fantastic job for England. And it deserves a knighthood, but it's time to freshen it up. And yourself, what do you think? Would he um, stay or go for you? I think he's going to go regardless. Yeah. Regardless of what happened. If we won it, he would go. If we lose, he'd go. I think it was just the end for him.